Today, I'm talking to you about how to update the Palkitty V90 firmware. And let's just dive right into that. And the first thing we are going to do is go to the Myu CFW, that's M-I-Y-O-O-C-F-W firmware update page on GitHub, that's G-I-T-H-U-B. Okay, so once we are there, we need to click on the English guide link under Pocket Go and Palkitty Q90 V90 section. Now let's find those items we need to download. We're going to look for uh, Q90 to V90 as we're using a V90, of course, and we're going to download that. Next, we need to download the 7-zip application to unzip the firmware file we have downloaded in the previous step. And once that is done, we need to download a SD card imaging tool. In this case, we're choosing the Bellina Etcher. Some people have used uh, Win32 Disk Imager for this purpose. Both pretty much do the same thing. We also need a partition software. There is an awesome software called Mini Tool Partition Wizard, which has a free version that is sufficient for our needs. Okay, now that we have downloaded all the software we need, it is time to unzip the firmware image using 7-Zip. After it has been unzipped, we need to write this image into the SD card using Etcher. Now make sure you have inserted an SD card reader into your PC. So to do this, we need to launch Etcher. Let's click on a select image file. Choose the recently unzipped image. And then we can select the drive name of the SD card to write to. And click the flash button. I'll fast forward to the end. Once flashed, we need to expand the main partition so that we will have all the space we need to add the games into the side of the partition. Now, if Windows prompts you to format the disk, just hit cancel. So after that, we will open the partition wizard. And then we're going to select the main partition. And in my case, that is the J drive. So I'm gonna right click on it and hit expand. Now select the size you want to expand to. I have selected all the remaining space by sliding all the way to the end. Now hit okay and press apply. Once Partition Wizard is done expanding, you can pull out the SD card and place it in your device and start using it right away. Just as I showed in my Pow Kitty unboxing video, I pulled it out and I immediately started using it. Um, no problems there. You should be able to use it immediately. And that's it. We have just updated our firmware for Pow Kitty V90. Thank you for joining me today. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments below. Please share this video with your friends, hit like, hit subscribe, and hit that little bell icon and you'll be notified anytime any new content is uploaded. And go out and have a tech-tastic day. See you later.